hello friends welcome to the new video of magento so in um, uh, here we are going to learn about how to add mini login in magento 2 so i will check you how it gonna be look closed magento 2.24 pub okay so we can see that we have a mini login here when i click on this hovering you can see that on hover we have a mini login with this one right login email address password forgot password sign in and register so this we are going to make it if i go and hovering it and uh, just going to log in with this one sign in you can see that i can sign in with that account also and same i have my wish list my account logout action buttons so how we are going to add such kind of things here in uh, magento so let's have a look on that same you can see that click on that they have also you can also remove that but here you can see that on the hovering we have adding the mini login okay so how we are going to add this kind of sections in uh, magento 2 so let's have a look how we are going to add so let's take a look so this is the project structure okay block customer data etc view and registration.php so registration.php you know about it right in block we have customer so let's move with the step by step with the etc file so etc we have front end we have di.xml where we are overriding the things so here we are overriding custom section okay and uh, we are replacing with my custom section data right so let's moving to that one so all these things are related to the mini card comes to the customer data part right so when i go to this one block customer account form.php so this is basically the form data right all the layout js data custom forgot password action link config get configuration okay customer registered url and can base url so all this data account and everything is come over here in the block so that we can use in our html file moving to the next we are customer data custom section so here custom section that custom you are logged in this here like you can see that when i try to log in okay what it says So it says you are logged in the custom messages moving to the next we have etc we already discussed front end and di.xml view front end we need to override the default layout so because header part and mini cart all the things are come in the default.xml so here we have a header wrapper we are adding a simple login link and on that note we are adding the pop up sorry the hovering part so you can see that container customer login okay and for login info form block okay all the things we have added so you can you can see that here we have rendering our component mini login okay mini login contents we are going to add our component so you can see here templates account link so this basically mini dot login dot html that is the full fledged file where we are adding wish list my account logout if it is not logged in then we are check uh, using that account we have added okay username password everything is like and you can see that we have added the same thing with the js part right you can see that this part is basically on the checkout process also you can copy that one and uh, add it over here okay so this is the same process that i am following okay moving to the next we have uh, web js that is view we login.js where we are doing the things forget password login everything you can see that initialize with authentication pop up base url login login form validation forgot password call forgot password 
customer name and close sidebar and uh, anything else I have skipped I think no so this is full uh, this is the module that we have integrated so if you have any query in that just let me know in the comment section so you can also make such a beautiful uh, like a mini, uh, mini login into your website so you can see that this is also done on the checkout process I will show you I'm going to uh, log out here so I'm going to add any kind of uh, product let me show you proceed to checkout and here you can see that there is a button sign in so this is the same thing right here you can also logged in because you can sign in and you can directly sign in right so this is the same thing that we have shifted to the home screen okay so any query any issue in that just let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day